With smartphone and tablet penetration increasing rapidly throughout 2013, it was important for the Internet Advertising Bureau to understand exactly how people are using their connected devices and the impact that this usage is having on traditional media and people's purchase journeys. To achieve this, the IAB partnered with research agency Firefish and used an innovative methodology that centered around respondents wearing fisheye cameras for three days, capturing how and where they use their connected devices, including desktops, laptops, tablets and smartphones. This methodology was supplemented by a mobile app to record people's purchase journeys, face-to-face -face debrief interviews with respondents and a large-scale online survey for UK smartphone owners. So the results show an increasing importance of digitally connected screens in people's lives, with one in two saying their smartphones are a lifesaver, and over half of the young people that we spoke to saying that they would pick up their smartphone during a lull in conversation with their friends. I think as regards to having it on me all the time is, is my phone. I, f I forget it, I don't really treat it as a media, in, in, my, in my head I don't really treat it, it's, it's a part of me in a way, it's just there, it's, it's in my hand all the time, if I need it, it's there. People have moved beyond dual screening and second screening to a world of omni-screening, where they constantly have access to multiple screens and an insatiable desire for content, be that for entertainment, to fill downtime, or for shopping, which is increasingly seen as a hobby in its own right. Laptops, smartphones and tablets have changed the way we shop, with shoppers bouncing between online and offline activities to get the right product at the right price. When asked to recall a recent purchase, four out of five people said that a connected device had played a role, either in triggering interest in the product, helping research different options or making the purchase itself. The research also found that although devices were used in a similar way when researching products online, when it came to making a purchase, consumers still favoured devices with larger screens and keyboards over smaller touchscreens, probably because of functionality issues. Device use also increased with category value, with connected devices being used more as the value of the item being researched or purchased increased. So one of the most interesting things about the research was it found there was almost a need for a new mindset when marketing to someone via a mobile. So people think of their mobiles as such a personal device, it's an extension of themselves, it's part of themselves, that brands really have to tread carefully and lightly when they're marketing to people. So if you do too much too soon or you ask for, for too much information, people are going to think it's an invasion of their personal space. So to make an analogy, brands when marketing to someone via a smartphone, have to think of it as going on a first date, they've really got to be on their best behaviour. <laughs>